What's good? It's Cadillac Tracks. This is going to be quick tip today. Quick tip number 73. Today's quick tip today, once again, quick tip is about the smart find. It's about the browser smart find function. Yeah, this is something I probably should have went over earlier in the series, but we got to go over everything because I'm coming to a close at 100 videos, everybody. We're going to start some new content. But I wanted to make a quick tip on the browser smart find function. This is a function you may or may not be aware of. Something that can help you because it's helped me a bunch of times. And um, your browser can get real big and have a lot of sounds and you're trying to find a certain sound. You might even remember the name of the sound, but you can't remember where it was. So you want to search for it and that's what the, the browser search function is. I wish they would have made it a little bit easier or clearer on how to do it. But um, what you can do is... Um, I keep a lot of drums inside of a specific folder. Um, this this folder right here, Drums 2016, it has a lot of drums in it. And so when I click on it, it'll open up and it'll it'll start to show drum kits that I have available. And uh, let's say I was looking for a certain sound, you know, like so. I'm just gonna go inside of this kit right here, which is this uh this kit right here is not opening up. It should be deleted. But uh, this kit right here, I'm gonna go in this kit and you can go in there and you can see that uh. It's got different sounds, and if I was looking for a specific sound, you know, um, that's probably not a good example because they're all just numbered. But if I went in here and I wanted to find this right here, it's called Plastic Beater. And uh, if I was looking for that sound, I didn't know where it was, you can use the Smart Find function. You can actually right click on the folder that you want to search, and it'll bring up that Smart Find in this folder. And you know, when it brings that up, you can actually type in what you're looking for. Yeah, my little search thing, I don't know where, that, where it is. It must be off screen or something. It must have lost focus. But when you bring it up, it'll bring up the little search dialog, and then you'll type in what you're looking for, and it's actually going to start searching your whole file or your whole folder that you look to search for for that sound. And the way it works is when you push enter, it'll search and it'll find the sound. And uh, it doesn't really tell you, but all you have to do is you have to push F2 to go to the next sound. So it found the first one and it's trying to show me at the very bottom of the browser. When I hit F2, it's actually going to go to the next place that it found it. So it's searching again. And just depending on how big the folder is, I guess it will depend on how long it's going to take to, to search. But it's actually pretty it's pretty effective to to go through the sounds and get to from one to another. This is a sound I guess that I probably only have that plastic beater. You know, it's so specific. I probably only have it in that one spot, so it's probably not gonna find it anywhere else. But if I was just to go to there search and type plastic. You know, plastic's a little more vague, so see there's one right there, and if I push F two, boom, here's another one. And another one and as I'm pushing F2 it's going to the next find that it found and it's going all over the place and it's just gonna keep finding plastics 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 so this is just a good way um, I'm pushing F2 to go forward let me see what happens when I push F3 I think it's F3 to go back yeah F3 to go back I don't know why they did that and then F2 to go forward it might actually be the um, reverse F3 to go forward F2 to go back but pushing F2 and F3, you can cycle through all the finds for that word or that sound that you were looking at. If it's taking too long, of course, you can always just push the X or you can push escape. It's going to search the whole folder for that. This is just a quick tip. If you're looking for a certain sound and you know the name of it, but you really can't find it, just right click on the parent folder where it is, go to smart find and just type in one of the words. And after it pulls up a search, push F2 and F3 to go to the next one. It's just a quick tip for everybody. If you didn't know, now you know. Make sure you subscribe. Hit like on my channel. One.